There are three ways to install TPO membrane, induction welding, mechanically attaching, or with adhesive. First, let's talk about the induction method using Elevate InvisiWeld, which is an induction welded system. This plate bonded membrane system is constructed by a bonding unit and cooling magnet. Before installing plates, chalk a line along the insulation to ensure a straight line. The three inch round InvisiWeld coated plates and fasteners hold down the insulation. Allow the membrane to relax for 15 minutes, then lay out and overlap sheets, three inches from sheet to sheet. While the machine is resting on the plate, press the button to activate the induction welding process. As the machine is pulled off, place a cooling magnet on the welding plate, which provides compression to the membrane and speeds up cooling time. Now let's move on to standard inseam mechanically attached membrane systems. Roll out the membrane and let relax for at least 15 minutes. Attach heavy duty fasteners with 2 and 3 8 inch barbed plates along the edge on the membrane markings. Secure the edge, then pull the next sheet in place with the appropriate overlap. Use the robotic welder to weld membrane seams. Complete any detail work, flashing curbs or pipes using a handheld hot air welder. If polyester reinforcement is exposed, be sure to seal the cut edge by applying continuous bead of Ultraply TPO cut edge sealant. Lastly, you can adhere Ultraply TPO using an approved adhesive. Once the insulation is properly laid and secured, roll out the membrane with the correct overlap and allow to relax for at least 15 minutes. Next, fold the membrane back onto itself, exposing the underside of the membrane. Do not butterfly the rolls. Once the membrane is properly positioned, prepare the work area for the application of the appropriate adhesive. Here, we're using the Elevate Jet Bond spray adhesive. As we begin, shake the spray canister for 45 seconds to mix. Attach the gun and hose and hold 12 to 18 inches from the membrane and spray. Dispense the adhesive while overlapping the application by 50%. Make sure to avoid spraying on any of the remaining areas to be welded, including the lap edges. Ensure proper flash off time of the adhesive has occurred and conduct a touch push test to verify. Adhesive should be tacky but does not transfer to finger. Once properly flashed off, roll in the membrane to mate with the substrate. Broom the membrane perpendicular to the long run of the sheet. Then roll with a weighted steel roller. Now the seams can be welded with a robotic welder. Finish any detail work with a handheld hot air welder. And remember to apply a continuous bead of Ultraply TPO cut edge sealant as mentioned before. For more information and helpful tips, please visit our website.